We begin tonight with the next generation of young black educators making a difference. Yeah, walking the halls at Austin East High School is Melody Hawkins. As she's changing the game by getting a seat at the table and advocating for students every step of the way. Eric, you all right? Did you get some stuff done yesterday? Melody Hawkins is a powerhouse of student-centered education. Every little seed that we plant as educators matters. Every little seed. 60 seconds to start your life in algebra. The former middle school science teacher accepted an administrator position at Austin East Magnet High School this school year. Her new role allows her to be what students need. Oh my goodness. Okay. I love you too. I think about my students like my family. It's okay to have these moments. It's not okay to give up. Like how to put it over here. Oh, okay. Hawkins makes routine rounds through the halls and classrooms, getting a read on how students and teachers are doing day to day. Being a role model really does support my students in seeing that it's, it's okay to look like me and continue to thrive against all odds. It's not easy, but we have to keep pushing. Hawkins says data shows persistent gaps in academic achievement between white students and their peers of color. She says if we want to support black students, we need to invest in black teachers. If we have educators who are educators of color and also happen to have a, a keen expertise in how to support students of color, then we should absolutely have them at the table making decisions so that we can work together to really come up with good plans to support our students. She encourages her students to set their sights high. You have a vision for yourself, and that vision is of success. What time? Uh, during advisory. Hawkins' success is reflected in her long list of accomplishments. There is no doubting her skills or passion for education. We need the passion, and that's something that's really hard to teach. Even in the best teacher prep programs, it's really hard to teach someone how to be passionate about seeing students be successful. So it's, it's necessary to, to have adults in the building who care. Because she believes through these halls walks the future. I want them to live with confidence, with peace, and with motivation to continue to grow. Because I absolutely know that they are the ones that will support our society to become better, more healthy, and thrive. This week, Hawkins received a national honor recognizing her inspirational teaching practices. She has been named the National University Teacher of the Year, which includes a prize of $50,000.